next category is that of the young learners, and we'll take that as being anywhere between the age of two. There are English classes for children age two onwards, up to perhaps the age of 16. One thing about young learners is that they tend, usually at least, to be self-motivated and enthusiastic, and they can keep up their self-esteem through a number of different things. So try to bear in mind when you're teaching young learners that you want to constantly praise them. When their self-esteem is high, they're much more likely to learn in an effective way. Do a lot of repetition, again in the form of verbal drills, singing songs and all those sorts of activities. Make sure that your speech is slow and simple. There is little point with our younger learners in using language that they don't even know in their own native language. So try to keep your language as simple as possible. Always try, whenever possible, to reference the individual person. So rather than talking to them as a whole group when something has not gone right, try to reference the individual. You need to be aware that as young learners they're going to have a very short attention span and therefore you need to prepare for that. So you need a lot of activities prepared because they will have a very short attention span. And perhaps most important of all, particularly for young learners, is to keep it fun. 